dramatic new video into our newsroom tonight showing the fury of bullets unleashed by a San Diego State graduate who killed two police officers in Santa Cruz. It was the first time anyone had been killed in the line of duty in that city. 10 News reporter Dan Haggerty is live at San Diego State with what the gunman did to those officers after shooting them. Dan. Yeah, Kim, thanks. Good evening. Jeremy Goulet used to walk the campus here. He graduated in 2000 with a degree in, of all things, criminal justice. But he always seemed to be on the wrong side of the law. When these shots rang out, two officers were already down. The first officers ever killed in the line of duty in Santa Cruz. We're having a tough time with this. We, we have never experienced anything like this. Two veteran detectives, Sergeant Butch Baker with 28 years on the force and Detective Elizabeth Butler, 10 years on and a mother of two. They were checking on 35-year-old Jeremy Goulet, a man with a long criminal past. This is Goulet in 2007, convicted in Portland of sex and gun charges. Police in Santa Cruz say he shot and killed both officers on the front steps. They were disarmed by Goulet and their Detective Baker's um, vehicle was stolen. Goulet had police and military training. He graduated from San Diego State with a degree in criminal justice in 2000 and was a Marine Corps reservist stationed in Miramar in 1998, later dismissed after he was cited for a peeping charge in San Diego. Police in Santa Cruz were investigating something similar. Goulet was accused of making unwanted sexual advances toward a co-worker after being fired from this coffee shop. All of it ending in a massive flurry of bullets behind his home. And when police took Goulet down, they said he was wearing body armor that he owned. His family described him as a ticking time bomb who would do whatever it took to keep from going back to prison. Reporting live tonight at San Diego State, Dan Haggerty, 10 News.